in the previous two parts we performed a hypsometric analysis and we plotted and found the hypsometric curve and we computed the hypsometric integration for the study area basin which is 73 and this value according to Sitrahla falls within the third category between 60 and 80 which represent the youth stage and thus the stage that passes by the study area basin is the youth stage in this part we continue the extraction of morphometric characteristics from arc hydro tools whereas we have arrived at C morphometric characteristics of the water network of water network it includes one stream order where we make a copy for it and we go to the exit file and we make a paste for it in the first line of the next column whereas the stream order is the first characteristic and the mathematic characteristics of the water network of water network where the stream orders of basin area were classified according to so three lab classification that mo modified from Horton 1945 the three lab method is summarized and that each tributary does not have a tributary it forms a first rank and with the converge convergence of each tributary of the first order gives a second rank and so on and the entry of the tributary of a lower order to a higher order does not affect the higher ranking for example entering second to fourth order to compute the stream order we go to the project in ArcMap and in it we go to the we go to the stream T the stream of four layer where the table of this layer contains the value of stream order for the sub basins which is pre present in the field title a grid code to extract the results of stream order values and the rest of the results from this table we convert this table into an Excel file
where we go to the R toolbox window and in it we go to conversion tools and we choose table to, to Excel and then Excel then and we choose table to Excel and input table we choose stream T dash stream of four layer then we go to output Excel file and we specify the save location in the desktop and we type the file name ec5 then we click on save then we press ok then a message appears a message appears indicating that table to excel completed then close then we go to the desktop and we open the excel file titled ec5 in which we activate the results in the field a grid, a grid code and in the grid code field which is stream order and we make for them a copy then we go to Excel file that contains the mathematic statistics and in it we go to the stream order field and we make paste the second characteristic of mathematic characteristics of the water network is stream frequency FS where we make a we make for it copy then we go to Excel file that contains morphotic characteristics and we make a paste for it in the first line of the next column and this characteristic it can be obtained by the following equation fs equal nu over a where fs equals stream frequency nu number of stream a equal area basin area in kilometer square to calculate this characteristic we go to excel file that contains mathematic characteristics We go to Excel file and in the second line of the field titled stream frequency FS we type the equation as follows as we see Stream frequency FS for the sub basins and for all study area basin appears as we see. The third characteristic in morphometric characteristics of the water network is 
الدرينج دينسيتي دي دي وير وي ميك فور ات كوبي Then we go to Excel file that contains the mathematical characteristics and we make a paste for it in the first line of the next column. And this characteristic, it can be obtained by the following equation, dd equal lu over a, where dd equal drainage density. LU equals stream length in kilometer and A equal basin area in kilometer square. To calculate the drainage density DD and according to the equation, we need LU, which is the stream length in kilometer. And to find the value of stream length, we make for it copy. And then we go to Excel file that contains contain the mathematical characteristics and we make a paste for it in the first line of the next column. To find the stream length value, we go to the project in ArcMap, whereas the stream length values are present in the layer titled drainage line the table of this layer contains the field titled shape length which represent the stream length value values to extract the result of the stream length values and, and the rest of the, the, the results from this table we convert this table into an excel file where we go to our toolbox and we choose table to excel and input table we choose a drainage line layer Then we go to output excel file and we specify the save location in the desktop and we type the file name ec6 Then we click on save then we press ok then a message appears indicating that table to excel completed then close Then we go to the desktop and we we open the Excel file titled AC6 and in it we activate the results in in, in uh, shape length field which is stream length and we make for them a copy then we go to excel file that contains the morphotic characteristics and in it we go to the stream length field and we make paste the value of stream length for the stream for the sub basins appears as we see The value of stream length for all study area basin is equal to the sum of the stream length for the sub basins as we see.
where the value of stream length in meter now we calculate the drainage density dd and to calculate this characteristic we go to excel file that contains the morphometric characteristics and the second line of the field titled drainage density dd we type the equation as follows as we see Drainage density DD for the sub basins and for all study area basin appears as we see. Now we calculated the value for the third characteristic in the, in the morphology characteristics of the water network which is the drainage density DD In the previous parts we did not calculate the value of the six characteristics in the topographic characteristics which is rigidness number Rn because it needs the value of drainage density DD and since the value of drainage density DD has become present or has been calculated we are now calculating the six characteristics in topographic characteristics which is relativeness number Rn which it can be obtained by the following equation Rn equal DD multiply h over 1000 where h equal max eleva elevation minus mine elevation in meter and dd equal drainage density to calculate this characteristic we go to excel file that contains the mathematic characteristics And in the second line of the field title, readiness number Rn, we type the, the equation as follows, as we see.
the value of rigidness number Rn appears for the sub basins and for all study area basins as we see. The fourth characteristic of the magnetic characteristics of the water network is is constant of channel maintenance C where we may copy for it then we go to excel file that contains the mathematic characteristics and we make a paste for it a paste for it and the first line of the next column and this characteristic it can be obtained by the following equation c equal 1 over dd where C equal constant of channel maintenance and DD equal drainage density. To calculate this characteristic, we go to the Excel file that contains the mathematic characteristics and in the second line of the field title, constant of channel maintenance C, we type the equation as follows. As we see, the value of constant of channel maintenance C for the sub basins and for all study area basin appears as we see in this part we are content with the calculating these four characteristics and the morphotic characteristics of the water network and in the next part we will continue to calculate the rest of characteristics and the mathematic characteristics of the water network. Then we save the result by pressing save.